no matter what kind of business development and marketing strategies you put in place in your agency or freelance business, email marketing should be at the top of the list. That's what I want to talk about today. I want to explain to you why email marketing is so important and why relying on social media or word of mouth and referrals is a huge mistake. So let's get on with today's show. When I meet a new potential client and I ask them how they get their business, they often rather proudly tell me that they've got all their business up until now through word of mouth and referrals. Of course, they should be proud of that fact, but there are two fundamental issues with that. First of all, they have absolutely no control over when those referrals come in. And second of all, they have no control over the quality or the fit of that referral for their business. And to be quite honest, relying on word of mouth and referrals is absolutely no kind of business development strategy. Or they might say to me, hey Rob, well I get all of my business through my social media platforms and my profiles. I post regularly on LinkedIn and Facebook and Instagram and Twitter and so on and so on. And that's how I get all of my business. But consider the fact that you don't own your social media and you're building someone else's asset for their business rather than your own. And because you don't own it, that means that at any time they can change their terms and conditions or indeed they can ban you altogether. Just have a look at this Instagram profile that one of my clients sent me this week. This really highlights the issue. This person had built their jewellery business solely based on their Instagram profile and the images of the jewellery that they make posting on there. And then for whatever reason, they got banned and they suddenly lost access to their two and a half thousand Uh, subscribers on Instagram and of course Donald Trump gave us another good example of this where he had 33 million followers on Twitter and overnight he was banned and lost all of those so social media is a platform that you're building someone else's asset on and you don't own and things can change overnight and you can lose access to all of your followers so both relying on word of mouth and social media as your key business development strategies is a really poor idea but there is a better way to generate high quality leads and that's through building your own email list. And if you haven't started doing that, if you have zero people on your list, then I would really encourage you to start today. Sit down, write a list of people that you know and start building your email list. Let's just consider seven really important facts about email marketing. So fact number one is that you are six times more likely to get higher click-through rates through your email than you will through your social media post. And when you're sending emails, you're having a one-to-one communication with your prospect or your subscriber, whereas when you are posting on your social media platform, you're, you're competing with everybody else that that subscriber subscribes to as well. The second fact I want to share with you is that email is 40 times more effective at acquiring new customers than social media. Thirdly, email marketing can generate up to 80% of your website traffic. And indeed, I always say to people, you wanna drive people to your website and then when they get there, make it really easy, signpost it really easily so they know exactly what you want them to do next, which will often be download some freebie in order to get their email address. And as I've been saying, the fourth point is that you own your email list, whereas you rent your social media. And that means with your email list, you are building a genuine asset in your business, whereas with social media, you're helping build someone else's business. Number five is that email is the most scalable way to make sales with new customers and then build deeper relationships with existing customers. So I get 80% of my business through my email list. You may well already be on my email list. And that is something that I can control, that I communicate regularly with. And that's how I convert those subscribers into customers in the end. Number six is that you can reach far more potential customers with email than you can with social media. If someone has signed up to download something, they're interested in your world, and then you can nurture them through your email marketing, and that is much easier to convert them into a customer than it is to try to do the same thing on social media. And number seven is that for every one pound you spend on your email list, you can expect a 42 pound return on investment. And there are not many platforms where you can get that kind of return on investment. You know, new trendy topics and technologies come and go, and email marketing may not be the most uh, sexy of those kind of trendy things like TikTok and so on, 
but it's something that is here to stay that works and that will continue to work where some of these other trendy technologies come and go. Now, if you're a regular listener to my podcast, The Agency Accelerator, I'll put a link in the notes below, then you will know that I always ask my guests if they could go back in time and give their younger self one piece of advice, what would it be? And if I did the same thing to me, I would say, hey, Rob, start building your email list now. Because if I'd have started my list 15 years ago, it would be way bigger than it is now. Having said that, you don't need a big list to convert and make get customers from you just need an engagement list so if you don't have a list as I said at the beginning start one now it's not about whether you've got a hundred thousand people or ten thousand or a thousand on your list it's about having a list of engaged people that you can convert if you had a hundred people on your list and they were engaged with your content you will be able to convert those people over time into lower customers so I hope you found that short video useful. I hope you also buy into the fact that you really need to be building your email list. And I wanted to let you know that I am running a series of masterclasses all about email marketing and list building. And so if you want to learn more and you want to get some strategies on how to create a list, what technology to use, how to build your list and how to nurture, engage with your list, then make sure you sign up for the next masterclass. Check in the links below this video.